We are back with today food and some great recipes from one of our absolute favorite chefs, Marcus Samuelson, a clean chef, philanthropist. His latest restaurant, Marcus Bar and Grill, opened this past March down in Atlanta. Before that, he debuted Havin Mar here in New York City. That was back in November. You've been very, very busy. Good yes, sir. and I was excited because you just came through to the restaurant, and that means that we're officially yeah. open. When Craig yeah. comes through, that means that we're open. And I'm not just saying this because you're standing here, but yeah. it was one of the best dining experiences that we've had in the city in recent memory. So, and Al was there too. Al Roker popped in. Yeah. Before we start cooking here, tell me about the spot down in Atlanta because this oh, is your first restaurant yeah. down there. This is our first restaurant in Atlanta. It's like brunch city. It's yes. brunch every day. And this dish that we're doing today is really inspired by brunch. It's okay. a shrimp and grits that we tweaked in from my heritage from Ethiopia, so we call it tips and bits, which is really a nice stir fry with grits. Why do we call them tips? Tips is a, a, one of the dishes that comes from Ethiopia. Okay. One, so we're going to sear off some beef. Uh, serve it with grits, and we're going to put some heat on it. But you know what? It. Can I tell you how excited I am? Yeah. Because it's the first time I'm cooking outside on the plaza live. How cool is this? Right? How cool is this? Summer's here. Wow. So we so got. What did you put in the pan to start? A little onion and garlic. Can we smell that? Can we smell that? <laughs> right? A little onion and garlic. A little onion, garlic, ginger. Some and we're going to add in our beef. Okay. Beautiful tenderloin of beef. And then this. This is Berber. This comes from my home country. What is that? What is that called? Again? This is a Berber. Berber. Berber, exactly. It's a okay. spice blend that you find all over Ethiopia. And it's a little bit, it got a little heat on it. Can I tell you what else, what, right? What oil, do, is that just olive oil? Just some olive oil. Okay, right. One of the cool things about living in New York City is that, you know, we have all these cool restaurants. Yes. And yesterday, I was invited to one of those Jenna and Hoda parties. Yeah. yeah. You know, like, they get invited to the fancy oh, party. Yes, they Like, do. we don't get invited to no. them. Savannah, you don't get invited to them. They only come off. I so I walked into the Marcia. Stewart was there. Oh, was there. Kind of party, was there, Marcia. right? Party. And I was like, I saw, I was like, where's Jenna, where's Hoda? I didn't get it. Danielle, restaurant Danielle yeah. turned 30 oh. Oh. yesterday. Oh. Can we give a big shout out to yeah. restaurant Danielle? Oh. And he was fancy. And yeah. of course, there was Hoda drinking in the corner. <laughs> you know. oh, by herself? Yeah. But she's here. You, you, you recovered fast. What's the, word, what's the word on the dish, boys and girls? It's, it's so so beyond. Beyond. It's really it's so good, good, right? No, but it's so much fun to be here on the plaza, yes. cooking outside, it's all bad. cooking tips and bits. I'm going to plate this for you. So you so said this is done. Done. And, and what do we add to it? A little bit, just like just like this olive oil, a little bit of butter. Just a little bit of butter. Just a little uh, bit of uh, butter, uh, right? Just, uh, just a snake. Just a little bit. A skosh, if yeah. you want. So look, look at that. Look how oh, nice that looks, looks right? Good. Hey, Marcus, what if you can't find that spice? Because it's, I love that smoked, spice. Where do you find it? Smoked paprika. Okay. You like spice. Yes. You're from Arizona. You like <laughs> chili, right? I do. I like yes. a little heat. Marcus. Yeah. So you I'd like to be invited to fancy parties. I know, but like, yeah, you know nah, what? Don't cut it. I got the card now. I'm next yeah. next one. We're gonna Me get and invited. Dilly to. Dilly wanna come. So the grits is cooked for about 20 minutes. A oh, little bit of cream, a little bit of water. You know the grits gotta be really, really nice and I creamy. Do. I take my grits very seriously. Yes. Um, mm. it, these are just beautiful. Look at these grits right now. Use water and milk. The water and milk. We Whole mix milk. it. Yes. Good. We mix it. <laughs> and Some now don't like to use we're ready to play. Look at this. Oh, uh, Look at so this. Mm. Are you guys eating over there? I don't hear any oohs and ahs. I don't hear any. I know, like, Hoda's not eating because she had, like, a fancy meal last night. The other one. The other one. Come on, come on. And so this is on the menu. That's it. Okay. Down at your new spot. How do you make the meat so tender? It, yeah. See, fancy. It's like tender. This is tenderloin, but you know, you just gotta cook it in a hot pan. Okay. Adding the berbere, mm -hmm. it's really, really delicious. You find it at Harvin Mar in Chelsea, and you find it in Atlanta restaurant. Mm. All right. Oh, it's totally we love it when you come back. Can I just say how happy I am to be here? It's so much fun. Thank you. Love it when you for having me. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you. By the way, you can find the recipes today.com/slash food. Go there and get this because you want to eat this for sure.